short film about a woman trying to do some tidying up for the holidays despite persistent visitors. Annyeong Haseo and welcome to Awful Advent, a countdown of 13 holiday horror movies for the 13 days before Christmas. This year's theme is Scary Santas, and for our third film, we're going back to what may be one of the first Christmas horror films, The Short and All Through the House, from the 1973 anthology film Tales from the Crypt. On Christmas Eve, a woman is menaced by an escaped killer dressed as Santa Claus prowling around her house. However, she can't call the police because she's just murdered her husband. I can't expand much upon that summary. The short is based on an eight-page comic and is one of five stories in a 92-minute movie. On top of that, it's only 12 minutes long. There's very little dialogue and very little drama. There's some nice tension as she hides from the killer and tries to lock all the windows and doors, but it's really stripped down. As they say, flesh this one out a bit and you might have an anecdote. To phrase it more generously though, the short is very efficient. Quite literally, all killer, no filler. If you expanded the story, for instance by having a conversation with the husband to define their relationship, or having her call a friend in a panic, you'd overcomplicate things. The former would try to add depth to her motives, and the latter introduces an accomplice or someone potentially conspiring to kill her. Either way, the story would start ballooning out and stop being about someone cornered by a killer dressed as Santa Claus and unable to call for help. I'll admit that I was a bit lukewarm about this short. I find the other stories in the movie more compelling, and the final one particularly memorable. The brevity of And All Through the House made me take against it a bit, but upon reflection that very brevity is its strength. What starts as a merry little murder gets invaded by a holiday horror and then whipsaws between the two. Despite the killer outside, there's still a body that needs to be disposed of inside. The tension comes from the way each situation prevents the other from being resolved. It's a good little short, and Tales from the Crypt itself is a solid anthology film, but a Santa does not a Christmas movie make, and that is the focus of this series. Tales from the Crypt is not a Christmas movie, not even in a pedantic, technically die-hard as a Christmas movie way. So while both the short and the movie are good, and I recommend them in general, I don't recommend them as something to include on your holiday watch list or to play in the background at your solstice party. That said, I still give this 3.5 out of 5 Joan Collins's Cornered by Creeping Clauses. Tomorrow, things went so well last time, why don't we do it again? Until then, stay safe and stay spooky. <laughs>